Mr. Toastmaster, fellow Toastmasters and distinguished guests, I believe that a good speech connects with the audience. And the factors that I use to evaluate whether a speech connects with the audience is looking at its content and its delivery. I have friends who would pay to listen to Kevin Spacey read the New York Telephone Book. That's an example of great delivery, but not so great content. And I'm sure all of you have had the experience of going to a lecture given by, on a topic that you really, really care about, and then the delivery puts you to sleep. So both are important, and that's how I'm going to evaluate Charles's speech. First, content. You chose a topic that I think was really relevant and is a concern to everyone here, regardless of where they stand on the gun issue. Everyone's concerned about the number of deaths caused by guns. So your topic was relevant. You grabbed everyone's attention with your starting point. You, and you get and you told, you took people on the journey of your analysis of data. Now I'm a computer geek who does spreadsheets. And I love numbers, and I know how hard it is to make the numbers sing to whoever you're presenting to. So I thought it was very clever in the way that you presented the data. It was almost like a mystery. What is it? Why is this happening? Is there a solution? And then you came to your conclusion that the data didn't appear to support any particular reason, any particular cause, or any pre prescriptive way to fix this. I was frustrated, quite frankly. I wanted there to be a solution in the data. So that was excellent content. Then delivery. You did a good job of scanning the audience and making eye contact. You used gestures. You changed the, your voice pacing. And you had pauses, again, to let us absorb the data. So now, what are some of the suggestions that I offer? First of all, as I said, I was frustrated at the end because I wanted a solution. I, want, I wanted the data to show something, something that we could work on, something that, we, some, something that we could make this better. And it wasn't there. And so I offer that you might want to make your, in your conclusion, you might want to express more frustration at where you ended up. Because you took us on this journey, you made it a mystery, you, you looked at all of the options, and this is a really big problem that we want to solve, and the data doesn't help. So one, refocus your conclusion, and two, with your, gest with your gestures and your delivery, open up a little bit more and match the passion of your topic. Thank you.